Hey, Pat, it's Midnight Designer, and we are back playing State of Decay Year One Survival Edition. And in our last episode, what is going on? What are you shooting at? In our last episode, we took care of the radio signal and we rescued some. Seriously, dude? Seriously? Like that. This is how you do it. So yeah, in our last... Oh, let's walk down the actual ladder. Uh, we took care of the radio signal. We rescued some scavengers who are now members of our happy family. Uh, before we go on and do anything else, let us level up some of our characters. Alright, so. Now we have been gaining all this valuable experience. Now if we scroll down here... We can start specializing in some Attention things. Survivors. Only those who Hang on, Judge. I'm busy. The so, I think we will specialize in pistol. Keep your guns and keep your own scavenge, you're on your own. And that's cool. So we got that. Okay. Wait, what? Damaged. How come it's not... It doesn't look damaged? Wait, did we not choose it? How do we not choose it? Okay, wait. Do we have to... Let's look at our shooting. See, our shooting is up. We should be able to pick it. Okay, what, what am I missing? Can we do this? Oh, choose this cue, Midnight Designer. If you read the stuff over here. Okay, I see how you are. So we will pick you and hit space, and then we'll pick you and hit Q. Right? Choose. Q. I choose you. I Q you. Q you. Um, I Q you. Q. Okay. So that's where you hit it. You don't like double click and then space and then choose. Okay. So on this end, we can. Wait, what? I can pick another specialization? Or does it. Does it switch? Let's see if we if we cho cho choose again. Oh, we have to double choose. I got gotcha. you. Now we got it. See, look at that. Now we cho cho choosed. So we can either choose to cho cho choose to run run very run very long time, or fight very long time. Um, either one is going to be awesome. So we would choose. Uh, we would choose to fight. Fight. Let's fight. Okay. So, in this episode, I think we're going to try to get to the Wilkerson's. But before we do that, uh, let's look whoa, at our map. Because we left our stuff here. <laughs> we got to go get it. Because uh, if you remember, uh, we had looted the... Who are you? Um, we had looted the... Um, yeah, I know. We had looted the uh, radio signal thing, and uh, we got a bunch of stuff. We put it in the trunk of our car, but I think we left it there. So we got to go get that, and then we got to go. Maybe we'll do the military thing, and then we'll head out and help the Wilkerson's because it's not lit up anyway. So, all right. So let's do that. And obviously, since we're going to get a car, let's not drive there. And we will use our, our brand new pistol skills. To hopefully uh, kill some zombies. Wait, wait, 
Wait, wait, what? Why is there a rock? There's some trouble we might want to look into. Uh-uh, uh-uh. I see you back there. Oh, back up. Ah. Oh, really? All right. Some weird rumors have been going around on the radio. People getting beat up, robbed, stuff like that. Any idea who's behind it? I don't know. Could be the old <laughs> it's a SWAT guy. Whoa, what was that? Oh, that was um, traps. <laughs> we just took out a bunch of zombies with our traps. Yeah, it might be time I had a little talk with the Wilkerson's. Yeah, we're working on it. Mickey's got that temper. I'd hate to think how he'd respond to an accusation like that. Oh, no, there's a big fat zombie. Whoa! <sighs> There's a big fat zombie. And we do not want to... Let's just go. Don't worry, that stop sign respawns. <laughs> as many times as I've run it over, I'm an expert on that particular stop sign. Okay, so... Okay, so we've got to get this thing parked. Are you actually hitting anything, Marcus? we got to take you out and train you up right in the ways of rifle. In the meantime, let me help you out. Eh. All right. There. There's that. Now, I'm pretty sure that if we look in here, we're going to see stuff. Right? Yeah, see, look at all the stuff we left in there. We just left it. That's no, that's no Gouda. Found this while I was out. Look at that. Lickety lickety loo. Lickety lickety loo. Okay. Let's get out. What? Did you actually. No, I was going to say, did you actually kill one, Marcus? No, you did not. These expired years ago? Well, how is that my fault? Okay, so let's see. Where are we? Uh, we've got this in and this in. All right, so let's take our lady out and we will help the military air raid on the zomberts and we'll open both instead of closing the one. We'll take the police car because that looks like it's in need of retirement. Wait, let's... So we are going to you. All right. So that's out on Route 66. So that I know where we're going. Right past that bloated Zombert. Or the big boy. Not the bloated one. Because the bloated one looks like the penguin. And explodes into a, uh, a cloud of poisonous gas. Very much like myself after Taco Tuesdays. He was right over here, somewhere. I guess he's gone. Good for him. Maybe he's off to Planet Fitness. Seems unlikely. Okay, so it should be here, right? Wait, is it not here? 
Oh no, wait, it's down down the main road. Sorry. I thought it was like on to way to to Wilkerson's. Alright, so let's get around round here. Wait. Well, I can tell you that if your air raid guys want to maybe just shoot right here, that would be a good spot. Found some zombies for you. And line up, please. <laughs> At this point, I just am anxious to tear the car up. Tense. People are starting to get. All right, I'm in the area. Eyes up high. Yes, we to do a little survey. Okay. All right. Well, I'd just like to ask you a few questions about your favorite dishwashing liquid, on a scale of one to five. No, it's not that kind of survey. All right, we're gonna go up here and look about. Oh, and of course, Zomberts will be coming. You see a horde? Sing out. Uh, really? Actually sing out? There's a juggernaut. He's one of your guys. There's a SWAT zombie. There's a trailer park. May want to just take that out There's preemptively. A want to check out. Target confirmed. Is that it? We done? Package inbound on your pod. I say again, on your pod. On my what? Package delivered. Have a nice day. Um, thank you. Mm hmm. Hmm. Okay, the SWAT zombie, I'm not going to be able to shoot anyway. And the juggernaut, he's way down there. Now, how did I, how did I get up here? How did I get into this situation? What? Oh, see, then you go down. Once you're going down, then you go down. And then there's one here in the middle. And once you go down, you go down. I think we should trade for the old-timey pickup truck hold on oh wait uh hi hello swat zombie um how are you i'm fine your pathfinding could use some work mine however is spot on have at have at ya favor while you're out there I'm uh, on it wait no never mind it's stupid you lost me I've been packing up my dad's stuff and I found a watch box it's from the birthday present I got him when I was 12 hold up let's take care of this first yeah hold up let's take care of this first how about we survive the apocalypse before we uh, worry Same. about I've been packing up my dad's stuff and I found a watch box it's from the birthday present I got him when I was 12. Uh-huh. Stupid little plastic thing with cartoon fish on it. Uh-huh. Better deal with this. Oh. Uh -huh. You were saying? I don't know why he kept it, but it kind of made me realize I don't have anything to remember him by. So I wonder if you only I'm level up if you actually hit zombies when you shoot, or if no, you have to, okay. or if you can just I'm shoot like in the air like you don't care. Uh, so let's go back and we'll take back a fresh vehicle, which we will try to keep fresh, but you know my track record for driving in this game. And then maybe, I don't know, we will maybe take Marcus to the Wilkerson's. It looks like we lost the dock mission. 
because now it wants us to go investigate the accusations and perhaps we have and of course we are not going to be able to keep our truck pristine oh wow that was pretty cool all right see that set up outpost friends so let us get this thing back and maybe switch for marcus and then we'll go out and see the wilkerson's whoops i smushed you Oops, over, over corrected. This is a terrible, uh, you know, for a first base. Oh no, there's a big one right there. We are going to have to deal with him. Let's see if we can do it with a firebomb. Oh, you got to dodge. You got to dodge that. Dang it, I didn't dodge in time. Come on, fat boy. Marcus, you could help a sister out. Yeah. Ugh. Ugh, I'm home. That was dramatic. And once again, I've opened both the gates. You really think we need a two wide opening for the base when the controls are this inexact? All right, so we are back. And let's see here. Marcus, let's switch to you and then do the loading screen which is new an added feature okay marcus what's up with you okay let's see here we will choose this specialization um powerful kick power yeah we'll do this one powerful shove i never I never wind up doing powerful kick powerful enough. Let's see. Um, blunt weapons edge. I, I feel like I want to wait, but maybe we'll make Marcus good with blunt weapons. And then just make sure he's got blunt weapons on him. Okay, so let's take you in for some inventory management. Oh, what are they doing? I cannot believe you. If you Ugh. want to run away again. Come on, Lily. That's not fair. Can I not do right, inventory management not. while you're doing this? We built a home here, and you just want to abandon it because things are getting tough. Mm -hmm. What's going on? I was just trying to tell Lily that we need to start looking for a new place to live. We're too cramped in here. That's and true. And our runners keep having to go farther and farther from the church to find supplies. Seems reasonable. Things have been pretty tight lately. Fine. Then maybe you should bail on us too. Um, well, I don't know how moving is bailing. But you know, 
Okay. Uh, so let's get rid of you. Let's get rid of you. Um, <laughs> and you, and you, and let's, and then, uh, Is this, how's this one doing? Short pump, uh, don't do blah, blah, blah. Okay, so what are, what are you? Maybe we should have looked at this first. Whoa. Hmm. Ammunition, 9mm, 44. 22, 45, 40. So we don't actually have a 357 I and mean, any ammunition for a 357. Well, that makes the decisions a little easier. Um, what's and what are you? An assault rifle, a 556. Five, uh, let's see how much 556 five, ammo do we have? Oh, you know what? Since we're going to the Wilkerson's, we are gonna. Uh, let's do that. And you know what? Can we get Maya? I know I'm jumping around here, but I'm trying to think. Can't do that right now. All right, let's do this. Let's switch to Maya, because we can give her maybe like assault rifle uh, skills. You know what I'm saying? So where's what's Maya doing? Is she like she's probably working hard? So switch to Maya and loading screen again. So I'm thinking if we switch to Maya, give her the assault rifle since we just made Marcus uh, skilled at uh, right, right, right. So wait, we can do see assault weapons, right? You see what I'm? You, you, are you buying what I'm selling? So now she is skilled at assault ref weapons. So we'll just now go give her an assault weapon, and uh, that'll be that. So we're gonna have three fairly skilled folks. All right, so we'll give you back, give you back, uh, give you back, give you back, give you back, give you back, give you back. Okay, so let's see here, take you, and then this, take 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, and uh, let's see here. We'll take you and you and in the miscellaneous. Something just came in over the radio. Wait, what? Have you got the location? Uh, hold on. Hold on. And we'll take this and then we'll attach it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And then we'll take three of these. Okay, now we're ready to go to the Wilkerson's, I think. So we are heading out to the Wilkerson's. Now, have I selected the Wilkerson's? Do they know we're coming? So we will take the long drive out to the country as opposed to like the big city here. Attention civilian, remain in your homes with the doors locked and the windows secured. Mm -hmm. If you do not comply with these instructions, the army will not take responsibility for you being chewed on by death. Thank you, and by America. Haha, <laughs> that's funny. You're a funny man. Okay, we'll probably run into about three or four hordes on the way out to the Wilkerson's. But who knows? Sounds like we're running this truck in the red, though, doesn't it? I 
I don't know when it looks like our stockpile maximum has been exceeded but I'm not sure what happens if that happens you know I mean does like stuff go bad do we throw it away because I keep seeing the warning like nothing's happening as a result of that oh dang it oh I was like why are you not all dead All right, let's go say hi. Hi. Talk to the boys if you're looking for a trade. I'm busy here. Wait, what? I'm not entirely sure what just happened here. Talk to the boys if you're looking for I have for some a trade. questions for you. Okay. I have some questions. Okay, we'll make some accusations. We've been hearing some rumors Those aren't on the questions, CD. really. People out looking for supplies, getting robbed, stuff like that. I see. And you're the law in this matter, are you? More like a concerned citizen. Yes, well, in, concerned in yoga story. pants. But we haven't had any problems here. We look after our own. And you wouldn't know anything about this, would you? Take a walk with me, will you? Let me see if I can explain how things are. Uh -oh. Funny thing about people, they don't much like to challenge their assumptions. Now, me and my brother, we done pretty well for ourselves and all that. I can't walk. All well, I can do is run. That and, well, it is in the character of very few men to honor without envy. Or women. Man who has prospered. Aeschylus said that. And an envious man is a man who will spread rumors. Really? About You're going to quote Aeschylus right. to us? Because normally, gun-running moonshiners are such upstanding citizens. Well, if you quote the Greeks, we're businessmen. Persons. It's all about seeing the long game. Rob a man, and he'll give you what he's got in his pockets. You sell him what he wants, though, what he needs, and he'll keep on coming back to give you everything he has. Did Aeschylus say that, too? Ah, uh, sassy. Here, let's ask Mickey. Mickey Mouse? Mickey, our friend here is curious if we've been stealing from our fellow survivors. Seems there are rumors to that effect. <laughs> Shit. If we was, wouldn't be anybody to spread no rumors. See? Nothing to it. I get the warm fuzzies. Why don't you run along, and if we hear anything, you'll be the first to know. Wait. Okay. Leave the area. Walk away. Tall. Walk away. Tall. Wait, why is there a circle there? Oh, is that the area I need to leave? You gonna tell me where I can go? What I can do? Apparently you are. Oh my. Look at that. Zombert's. Um, did you see? Oh, is that the area? Is this the area I need to leave? You see the dots? Um, wow. I'm presuming those aren't zombies. I mean, some of them clearly are. But, like that horde right there, which we are going to bypass like these. Wilkerson's, have a horde. Get a horde job. All right, well, we have seen the neighbors. Whoa. I'm not gonna be able to do quick, quick maneuvers on. Oh, <laughs> Feral, you, you suck at video games. But I'm pretty sure they know something about it at least. Oh well. Get off the hood. All right. Perfect. Our friends and neighbors. Yep. What should we do? Well, we're gonna end the episode. We just tell our runners to stay extra sharp. Yep. If you like this video, please hit the like button. If you want to see more, subscribe. If you want to start a conversation, why don't you start one? Where? In the comment section below. We're going to have to find another car before this one explodes. And hopefully there's one up here at the end of the road. And there is. Looks just like this one. Hee <laughs> hee. 
I love jumping out like that, even though it costs us a little. Yeah. See, we're fine. Thanks for watching. And have a great day.